Hey everybody, Tony George for DocSports.com, Sports Betting 101 series. You know what we're going to talk about here today? How many times have you watched a sporting event, football, basketball, baseball, what have you, and you ask yourself, how did odds makers, how do they get those lines so tight? No better person to ask than my guest here today, Matt Holt who was Chief Operating Officer of CG Technology, ran seven books here in Las Vegas. And Matt, everybody wants to know the secret. Who sets the odds and how are the odds set at sports books here in Las Vegas? So interestingly enough, um, sort of the openers are set by different books for different sports. But at the end of the day, whoever the first book is to come out with odds for a specific sport, it all starts with statistics and power ratings. And from that, you're able to build a baseline number, a little bit of anticipatory action on which team may be hotter or trendy, uh, and then you build an opening number. And what's interesting is the rest of the market is almost obligated to follow once that market is set. You know, if you make a, a football game, New England Jets, New England minus seven, and that you know, it stabilizes is the number. If other sports books go off a, a different number, they're only going to take action. You know, if some other book makes it eight and a half, they're only going to take action on the dog, which is why you essentially see so many sports books with the same numbers. But that first set of numbers always starts with a really good core set of power ratings, uh, along with a little bit of anticipatory action. And the lines move based on public action is that correct yeah and they always move more early so early on right. when the lines are brand new um, you know betters will come in and look sharper betters are the ones that tend to bet earlier because the public tends to bet closer to game time so as your sharper betters come in early you're able to move that number more until you start to see two-way action come in and then that's what we call a stabilized market number sports betting 101 right here docsports.com right here on our YouTube channel be sure and tune in more Sports Betting 101 things coming your way. And be sure and check us out, DocSports.com.